Hey guys, what's up? This is Rosa Pena. Um, I just wanted to make a quick video to show how to make custom tabs for your page. Um, I've been on this for a couple of days already and I gotta say it's been kind of difficult. You know, I've been on Google, I've been on YouTube and Facebook has updated <laughs> incredibly. You know, they're always making changes. So it was kind of difficult to do it. Um, so what I used was, I'm going to show you a real simple way to do this. So you're going to search on Facebook for WooBox, okay, uh, we'll click the custom tabs, pardon me my computer is a little slow, you know like I said I've been killing this, you know I've been up since 5 o'clock in the morning and I finally cracked this down, I gotta say I'm very excited. That I was able to finally do this okay so you see I've done it a couple of times so I'll just click OK um, click a tab that I haven't used choose my fan page add a page tab Okay, authorize the tab. Okay. Okay, so here we go. Sorry for my PC is slow right now. I need to restart this. Okay, so this is a beauty that I wanted to show you guys of how I cannot express how emotionally happy I am to share this with you guys. So, okay, so you want to make a website with the iframe. So what you want to do is that you want to put in HTML. How do you get that website, the HTML from that website? Simple. Go to the website, right click it, and click view page source. This guys will give you the HTML. You want to copy it, go back to Facebook, paste it. If you cannot paste it with right clicking it, you could press CTRL and the letter V, and that will paste it for you guys. Alright, so um so I just wanted to put this right here. Test. Um also let me show you how you will change the the tap so let's say you know you have a picture already you chose one um let me see which one pick a picture from here that i could use really doesn't matter okay let's say i wanted to use this picture now what happens is that you cannot just do it like that i already know this but because i have to change it you gotta resize it. So what you wanna do to resize your image is go to pickmonkey.com. All right, guys, that link will be below as well. So you wanna upload your image here. So let's go for that picture. Okay, open it. I'm so excited that this work, oh my god, I've been updating my page for the last few days, you know, on my cover, and I'm really trying to, you know, put this down to, you know, to feeling good about my page and, you know, interacting with others and getting along with others and being able to share with them what I know. So here we go, guys. What you want to do is that, you see, I just unclicked this. You want to click, you want to uncheck keep proportions and then one 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 times 74 that will be the exact image size for Facebook so what you'll do is that you'll save it okay let me not save it the same I might use that later okay so I'll save it I'll go back on Facebook I'll browse it and look for it so it's right here and then I'll click save settings 
just let it work, let it do its magic. You go scroll back up, grant the permission. Once again, grant the permission. <laughs> it asks us for so many permissions, these things, but it's worth it. Alright, so once that's done, okay. Hmm. Okay, so setting has been saved. Click view tab and booyah! I know you guys are loving it because I am loving this. And I was able to come up with this and I'm so thankful that I came up with it because now I'm able to help anyone that needs this type of help because I know there's a lot of people right now searching how to make the custom tabs for their pages and this is being ridiculous so there you go guys i hope you guys really enjoyed this video sorry about the slowliness you know my computer is a little b right now um you know thank you follow me on my facebook the link will be right below let's connect you know let's be friends let's share and thank you very much for watching my video have a good day guys